30th of November, uh, another newsletter. Um, and we're coming up towards the end of term. Very long, tiring term. The children have done amazingly. A uh, few things to run through, bring up to date with a few things. So, um, it's the 850th anniversary of the church and the celebrations were meant to take place uh, during uh, the summer and obviously lockdown got in the way of that. The uh, idea is on the weekend before Christmas, so it's the 18th to 20th, there will be a large projection display taking place on the church, on the side of the church. And all of your children have made some decorations and drawn in some baubles that will be projected on there. So please do take your children on the Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Have a look. Uh, hopefully you'll see uh, your child's uh, artwork up there. Um, been contacted by Tarina Jones at the library. Uh, we're coming into Tier 3 um, starting uh, tomorrow. They uh, just want you to know at the moment they're looking to continue using Click and Collect. Um, there are Christmas activity packs for the children to come and uh, collect, so do go and see those. And they are still open for return of items, collection of reserved items. There are pre-booked computer sessions and printing and photocopying, so do support our library. You know how passionate I am about uh, making sure we support them. In the newsletter, at the moment it looks as though um, the testing uh, regime will continue in this country, so there are SATs dates, just to make you aware. I know that if, as we come into vaccines there will be families who will be looking to book holidays. Please will you just come and talk to us about those to make sure that we can work with you uh, on that, particularly if your child is in uh, year one, year two and year six because we have the um, national testing in those year groups. We have had some funding from Councillor Tennant uh, from his community project budget. So we will have a lovely tree going up outside my office and a couple of other things. So I'd like to thank him for his support. Um, if your child is coming up to nursery age or is at nursery, come talk to us about nursery places. Uh, they're doing a fab job over there. Um, I spent uh, this morning in the woods uh, with them. Uh, I had my wellies on and it was uh, absolutely wonderful with them. Uh, we also are coming up to that point in uh, January where will be the closing date for reception places. We are still trying to find a way of how to get parents in under Tier 3. We can't uh, have people on site, which does impact upon um, volunteers, I'm afraid. Though we have something that will be coming out for people who may be able to help us with a little reading project. Uh, so please do look out for that. Um, I have two... Um, uh, vacancies coming up um, because we have some staffing changes um, I have put in the newsletter Mrs Gowdy uh, and Mrs Thompson are both moving on at the end of this term from year one uh, letters have gone out to parents in those classes and um, Mrs Wesley has decided to retire at the end of this term after more than 30 years working with us um, predominantly in um, early years um, I really would like to thank uh, the three of them for all their huge support and their great work over the time I've worked with them and obviously with the uh, previous heads as well. Um, so there are two adverts coming up, uh, or two vacancies. Uh, one is for uh, a teaching assistant uh, rolled uh, in reception. Um, details on the website. We also, because of work we're doing with other schools in terms of providing school dinners, have two catering assistant casual uh, hours roles. That closes on the 4th uh, of December, this is this Friday, and then the uh, reception one uh, closes on Monday. Um, and then finally, uh, the other thing, just want to go through Christmas uh, arrangements. Nativity is being filmed and we will get it to reception parents. I think we will make it through the website on a password protected page or something like that. Parties will take place in year group bubbles um, and we will provide refreshments. Please don't worry about that. We will still have a special visitor. We have had special permission for uh, uh, within tier three for that to take place and we'll do it in a COVID safe way. Uh, the Panto, uh, obviously we can't have the uh, Panto company um, in, but we have managed to source one which the children will be able to watch on the big screens in the classrooms. Um, we 
are looking at how we're going to hold our services and don't know whether we can share that with parents but we're trying to find ways we can do that and finally uh, Christmas cards if you want your child like, like to do cards they need to send them just for their year group bubble please because we can't find ways of doing it safely across that so that's in their year group um, and in by this Friday, Friday the 4th of December, we'll quarantine them and then on the 11th we'll distribute them within bubble so that's then safe. Please make sure the name is clear on the envelope uh, so we know who it's going to and don't put any sweets or treats in those um, and I'm afraid that we can't be, um, often we'll uh, support people bringing presents in for other children, we can't do that. So um, it just seems at the moment with... Um, so much what I'm doing with regulations and with restricts, I'm telling you what you can and can't do, and I am sorry, but you know, th what I would stress is the children are just doing so fantastically. We have our uh, our terminally look at books and, 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 and everything with uh, Mr. Singleton uh, this week, and we're in preparation for it. The work we're seeing in the books is absolutely fab. Uh, please do keep reading with them at home. Please do keep working on times table rock stars uh, and the spellings. Uh, I'm seeing some really proud kids on Fridays. The work that's being brought to me, that you know, for children who were off school for so long, their handwriting, not just what they've written, but the way it looks as well, is absolutely um, really, really uh, praiseworthy. There's some great stuff happening in schools, and the great sadness is we can't then share that with you. So I will get another newsletter out before Christmas. Thank you for all your support and your patience with us during this term. Um, and there, there are times when uh, we, the, the, the uh, guidance has come out only the night before the, uh, we, we're in school the next day. But uh, we seem to have got through it. Fingers crossed for the next three weeks and um, we will be able to uh, wish you a really happy Christmas and uh, a, a good holidays before then. Thanks ever so much and please stay safe.